Akron Children's Hospital is taking old ideas and reinventing the way we treat concussions in student athletes. And they're looking for help from students and their families in the area. Healthy Living reporter Kristen Mannion explains. One of the first principles of treating injuries. We all hear about icing elbows and icing your wrist if you fall and, and you know this is taking a new approach to maybe think about maybe icing the head, icing the brain. Could reinvent the way concussions are treated. It has a device where it will run an alcohol water solution where there is a, a cool down period over 10 or 12 minutes um, and then it'll stay at about 6 degrees Celsius which I think is like 43 degrees Fahrenheit for about 30 minutes um, and, then, and then we like to see how they're feeling afterwards. After about a year of trials, the results are promising. Kids who feel like they are uh, recovering a little quicker and feel like their symptoms do abate a little bit. The process looks at short-term symptoms as well as long-term impacts. We look at their symptom scale, which is pretty uniform. Uh, we look at the symptom score. Uh, we look at their neurocognitive functioning, and we use a computerized test for that. Um, and then we look at their balance. Um, so it not is, it's not all just their subjective complaints of my head hurts and I don't feel right. Um, there's more to it. Though there's plenty of research still to be done, Dr. Liebig says the student athletes of the Mahoning Valley can help Akron Children's find an answer. We're the only place in the world right now that's doing this, um, you know, with, with the hopes of getting enough kids recruited um, to show that this may be something that other organizations would be interested in and we hopefully will extrapolate this to around the country um, and see if we can't get bigger numbers to prove that this may be something that will help kids get better faster. Well, Matt and Leslie, it's definitely an interesting concept. And one of the things that they were telling me is it's not just student athletes. You know, they say more than 50% of all of the concussion cases they get aren't even sports related. Wow. It makes sense. I wouldn't have thought about that, but that does make sense. A lot of people get concussions. Gotta watch out. Specifically in teenagers, they said. And so uh, within eight days after the concussion, they'll take people in, this, in the trial, 12 to 21 years old. And if anyone wants to get involved, they can find the information on our 21 News app.